Hey guys, welcome back to another tips and tricks video. Today we will cover a few tricks regarding smashers, anomalies, whack -a trolls and blue glow siphons. This is the third tips and tricks video I've done, so be sure to check out my previous two for other simple random tidbits of info you might not or might already know. Before we get into it, let me market myself just a bit. For those of you that don't already know, I'm a live streamer over on Twitch. I stream pretty much every night from 8 p.m. to 2 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That's West Coast time. We are a growing community of PvE players across all platforms. I got PC players, PlayStation 4 players, Xbox players, and that's it. Because there's no other platform. So... If you have any questions or want to meet some more players that enjoy PvE, feel free to swing by. However, be warned, it's technically an after hours stream, so if you get offended easily, it's probably best that you just take your binky back to bed with you. So, okay, enough of that. Let's get into it. Alright. Smasher. Teddy bear. Actually, I want to try Tesla coil also. Hey, buddy, wake up. Look, you can stop him from charging. Yeah. I don't see any number. That la The laser beam doesn't do anything, man. The laser eyes, 1262, consistently. Zap. Zap. There's no... Look at his life bar. There's not anything. All right, let's try uh, Tesla. Oh, I goofed. I goofed. That'll work too. Wait, so that has a chance to crit. Does Teddy not crit? Teddy might not crit. Teddy doesn't crit. Those laser eyes are garbage. I wish it would have, what they should have done is turned the bullets into energy. But anyways, you can block a smasher. With Outlander abilities. You're done here. Uh uh. Dun 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 dun. So you activate the blue glow siphon. La di da. Turn it on. Walk away. Everything spawns. We're just gonna go hang out in this house over here. Watch some TV. Kick back. You know. Oh, poor blue glow. No. <laughs> Come on, husks. Do your job. Let's go. Yeah, 20 seconds. Let's go, sissies. Oh, there they go. Those guys are going to get it. Yeah. There we go. Failed. Boo hoo. Ooh, another blue fragment. So now, I just got two free blue glow. Without having to wait for night time. For those of you that don't know what I mean by night time, at night the map starts to get riddled with blue glow. So there's scarce 
little bits of blue glow when you first load in, and then after the first nightfall, blue glow becomes abundant on the map. Alright. How to fight smashers. You always want to stay close. Not that, I mean, obviously if you're like two tiles away or more, he'll charge, right? Let's get him away from this tree. So they have two attacks besides the charge. The overhead. And then a jump. And the jump is when you're pissing them off. So you can come in. Circle him, miss, he'll jump now. Oh, wait. Let me get away from that tree. And that's an AoE, right? So you let him do that, you keep hitting him, and then you run away, and you come back in. You can hit him, you can hit him, dodge it, he'll jump. Jump, jump away, and run back in. Overhead. He'll jump. Run back in. He'll jump, run back in. Now if you stay like this far away, that's about charging distance usually. Maybe not. Come on, man. You're not going to charge? Alright. Ow! You gotta make sure you get away from it. It's got some good range on it too, so you gotta make sure that you're out of the way. Even his uh, his one the overhead slam. If you're uh, beside him, it'll still hit you. Let's see if I can show it to you. Swing. Come on. Whoop. Yeah. See, if you're beside him, and then it sucks you in front. Uh, and it's been kind of nicknamed the vortex. It'll pull. Even when you're running away, it'll pull you back. See, it pulls you back into him. It's weird. Yeah. Yeah. All right, anomalies. Anomalies. Oh, man. I don't want to build out there. What? You can use... Used to be, for a brief window, we could shoot these things. Not anymore. But we can now. This target's a tricky one. Keep searching. Well, if they didn't want to go underneath it, Watch out. you hit them with stars. You can also use your anti-m anomaly weapon. Nope. Gotta run over there. I'm too lazy. Oh, look how easy that was. And four blue glow. Yeah. So ninja stars and rockets. Or you could run over and hit him with your pickaxe. If you wanted to. All right, blue glow trolls. Most of you probably already know this, but uh, I didn't for the longest time. So maybe some of you don't, especially you newcomers. Wait. Good, they're going the other way. So you got to hit this guy six times once he comes up before you finish it. Every time you hit him, he goes back in the ground. More holes pop up, thus making it a little harder to find the whack a troll. Uh, or you can actually hit him twice. One, two. 
three, four, five, six. Look at that. Simple. Easy peasy. You can also shoot them and hit them with your melee weapons, but it takes longer. So use your pickaxe. Use your pickaxe. God, but I've seen it to where we have like 15 different holes popping up. You're like, what the heck? <laughs> well, now, hopefully you learned a thing or two. If not, well, thanks for the support anyway. <laughs> if you have any of your own tips or tricks that you feel are unique or just cool or whatever, please feel free to let us know in the comments below. I always love hearing about new things and stuffs that people do in the game. Oh, by the way, for those of you who feel like that Atlas Cheese video is an exploit, <laughs> you are absolutely 100% incorrect, my friend. It is in fact a game mechanic that Epic has put into place, but it is only intended for those who actually, legitly, fail the Atlas. It's a mechanic to make it easier. Um, and we're not going to go into that rant, but you're wrong. Now... On that same note, there is an actual bug slash exploit that I've recently learned regarding the evacuate the shelter missions. I guess it's been around forever. It happened to me accidentally a long, long time ago. Um, I didn't know it was a bug. I just figured it was a glitch in the matrix. But uh, since it's actually not intended and it is an exploit and a complete full-blown cheese, I will not be showcasing it. So, but I'm sure there are plenty of posts over on Reddit. If you are curious. And there might be some other YouTubers that have covered it as well. Uh, it's been around for a while. Anyways. Go check it out. You cheaters you. Anyway. That's it. I'm out. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye now.